guys, it's Felicia from Go Graham Go, and today I want to show you the Juvie Caboose Ultralight Double Tandem Stroller. It's actually a stand-on tandem stroller, and we were able to put it to use uh, over the past two weeks, SeaWorld and Animal Kingdom. It came in very handy. Um, it is 21 total pounds, so if you're looking for a double stroller or a tandem stroller, it's one of the lightest strollers on the market. Juvie also has um, another caboose. Mm. This is the ultralight, so I just want to make sure you know that there is a difference. This one's 20% lighter than the original. Um, here's Graham. He's going to demonstrate. You want to sit down and show them? So, so, of course, older children, they can either stand like this. There's nice handlebars. Or they can sit. There's even a, a buckle that they can buckle in with if they would like, um, which ha was really handy in the parks because Graham is five. He just turned five. And... Um, so he doesn't, he's too big for a stroller, but you know when you're in those parks, the kids get tired. So that came in really handy. All right, thank you, babe. I'm going to get up and I'm going to show them the rest. Also, the stroller has what my husband really likes, is the uh, sort of a nylon compartment up top. Great for drinks. It has storage, a zippered storage here so you can put your phone or change. And then it also has a Velcro pocket on this side and another pocket that's not Velcro on the other side. We put our maps, um, snacks, all kinds of things in there. And it just kind of fits snugly over the handle. One of the cons that we found is that the handle is not adjustable. So, you know, if you're really tall, it may be uncomfortable. For me, it's fine. For my husband, it was fine. He wished it was adjustable. Um, we're average height people, though. So, um, another and here's what makes it go faster. That is the brake. That's the brake. Now that actually holds it together, but it does have a brake down here at the bottom. Just a regular foot brake like you expect on any other stroller, so it definitely has that. Another cool feature that I really like about it is the storage. I hope you can see this on put the video. The thing up, put the thing down. Oh, really Let go. So you got storage underneath the seat. So you see it just slides like this. Storage is pretty ample. Um, we were able to fit everything we needed in here. I do wish that this somehow would lift up. That would make it a little bit easier to get to the things underneath, even when you've slid in the seat out. But you see it does slide, which is handy. The canopy is but really... But the thing that I really like is to do wheelies. Yeah. That's not what you're supposed to do with it, though. But okay. I like to do that. Let's show them the canopy. So here's the canopy. It works for both of the children, as you see got the nice cutout. Hold on, let's open it up so they can see it. And actually, come stand around here. It's hard to do videos when you're by yourself. Okay, so you've got the nice cutout right here so that it's not um, totally hitting them if, so when it's down, you know, if your child was tall. But anyway, so there you go. And then the canopy goes over nice mm -hmm. over the front. I actually forgot sunscreen. I'm a bad mom. Um, when we're at SeaWorld, and neither one of them got sunburn. Graham got a little bit across the top of his face. Davis got none. So thankful to this canopy, he got none. Um, so of course this is where Davis goes. Flashpoint harness, little snack tray up front, and the back also reclines, which is nice. When it's reclined, the, the amount of room that the child back here has is reduced, but Graham was able to still sit there comfortably even when the seat was reclined with his brother. Okay? Um, it also has a nice foot rest on the bottom that you can also adjust. So hopefully you guys can see this. So you can lift this out, and there's a little portion under it there, and you can adjust the footrest. Let's pull this out a little bit. So nice, when they fall asleep, they've got some comfort there. Overall, great stroller to have, excellent for parts, especially have an older child or a younger child. And let me show you how it folds down really quickly. It is very long. I have a Subaru out back, and it takes up the entire length of the back of my car, but it folds down very flat, so you could definitely store on top of it. Let me show you how it, it works. Just pull up on these two red buttons, push forward, and you're done. You guys can see that. It folds down really flat, really easy to pop it out. Same thing. And you can even latch it so it stays close. Pop it out, just pull up, and you're set. Again, this is a Juvie Caboose Ultralight, 269 on Juvie.com. Thanks, guys.